fight. Go, go, go! I'm the shredder. No, I'm the real shredder. Take your cheese, smell my feet. Welcome to Adventure Fun. <laughs> Guys, we got a keto. It's the Legends of a Keto. And this one, we got the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. Now we have the Battle Arena, which includes uh, Shredder and then Leonardo, the leader. And then we got all four that want to team up against, you know, Shredder. So you got to give them all a chance, right? And then if it doesn't work out, I got my nerd gun. Nerd! <laughs> this is my first time doing a keto, guys. So let's go through this together. First, we want the Battle Arena. So there you go. It's Nickelodeon. And it's got Legends of a Keto. And it's Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles Battle Arena. And it's got 35 plus real battle sound effects and it's got cowabunga and you have the mini battling action warriors and includes exclusively Leonardo and shredder works with every akito warrior and it requires three double eight batteries batteries not included there's the top there they're battling it out here's the side their actual names and then here's the back um, says the same thing, but this time you can see that the stage is set and it's got it includes four arena backgrounds, which looks awesome. And it's got a scoreboard sliders. So, hey, I don't know how they score it, but we'll see how it, you know, maybe lose an arm, you know, disembodied limb or something. And then you get one point kind of like hangman, you know, you keep cutting him down until he's nothing. <laughs> also, I'll see. So you got the turtle power controllers. So you go ahead and move them and smack them back and forth. And it's got the ultimate turtle battling experience. And it says ready to fight, split, strike. So for every strike, you split something off. So if you can't use his right arm, you keep fighting until you use his left arm, then his head. And how many body pieces are you going to lose? And it says the Ultimate Turtles battling experience, and you can collect them all. You got Raphael, Crane, Leonardo, Rocksteady, Michelangelo, Bebop, uh, Donatello, and Baxter Stockman. It'd be kind of cool to see how they all battle out. But we're going to start with this one. We want some sound effects, because I can't make all the sound effects. <laughs> you know, it just doesn't work. Of course, they got to be really hard hitting. Better be careful. That's an exposed knife. <laughs> These guys are just waiting for me to slip up once. Going, ah, ah, I ain't gonna do that. <laughs> well, not this video, hopefully. Uh, this comes off to the side. That comes out. So first things first, we got to look at. Oh, these are the backgrounds. Okay, cool. So four different backgrounds you can have when you're battling. Okay, what's this? Okay, guys, so we got this side and all the ones you can collect as we just went over. And uh, you can go ahead and check them off. And exclusive with TNT Battle Arena, you can see down below it's Leonardo and Shredder. All the others we got to collect in the two packs. So it's available across Series 1. And then on the other side, you've got the uh, basic game rules and the official rules. And then outside of that, you have the actual setup for the Battle Arena. Okay, this side says how you set it up and how you get them to battle. And then the other side are the power codes. And the power codes just, you know, to make the most of your battle arena with these moves um, if you you have training mode you have battle mode if you're just doing one that's in training mode if you're using both of these then you're in battle mode and so it sounds like it's going to make some sounds and cool effects through the sounds that's what we're going to do oh here's the background so there's this side and you can see player one player two and then this side you flip it over he's got the act there and it's got you know the player one player two and it goes all the way from green to ko to knowledge override knockout <laughs> Okay, my mom's looking at me like, I don't know if he knows what he's doing. There's this other card right here. That looks cool. And then flip it over. There's the other background right there. Actually, this one looks like the Mr. Machine. It's green. It's a machine. So let's go ahead and get these guys set up. Get the controllers. And if you pull on the knob here, it's, uh, I don't know if you can see it, but it's purple. So that's going to be for Shredder's controller. Because over here, when I take this controller out... Pull this one down, and that's going to be Leonardo for light blue. I guess you can have it on different platforms, I suppose, but uh, we'll see. So there's the stage. Here's the uh, on-off try-me button, but we need batteries, and we'll put those in in just a minute. There's the speaker right there, make the effects, and there's the bottom where we can go ahead and put the batteries in. Oh, that's nice. I want to play! And there's this. There's your stage, and we got to get our little figures out. So there's Shredder, all loose, ready to get kicked or punched. And here's Leonardo. Man, he feels pretty noodly and limber. So I guess when you split him and stuff, there's got to be a way to put him back together. So how do we do this? Yeah, maybe we'll just go ahead and put the batteries in. Use a Swiss Army knife. See if I can... Oh, it's okay. I am a professional injurer. Oh, God. Here we go. And just put that in. Should be on off. We'll turn that one off. It seems like it's going on for a while. Oh, 
okay, dough. You're okay with your dough. They had to come out with one instead of a Kato. It's like, okay, dough K. <laughs> you heard it here first. Let's go ahead and put this on. Now, so the stage goes out here. This is gonna go somewhere in the back. All right, lock and load. And then, uh, does it matter which side we put these guys on? So place warriors. So in the picture here, they show it on, they face it to me, on my left for uh, shreds. And this is uh, shreds. Oh, look, they actually have them where you can put your little figures in here too, right? That's cool. So you can like have these guys up here going, man, I'm eager to get into battle, let me in. Camera mom is saying, hey, the turtle's on this side. So you think you put the turtle side on this side and the evil guys, you know, over here. I guess, I mean, we could try that and see if it makes a dilly over difference. I assume this goes down here. Is it snap on or what does it do? This may take a little bit of pressure. Okay, there's the pressure. I'm just nervous because man, toys can break. There we go. Woo! Do we add him like add out here? Okay, so this side we put him on right there there and look if you look at the top part of this coin or this disc he's on it's got a four and an eight and so in the instructions it actually explains when you play the game what they mean it says that the, there's the damage points is on his right side so he does as you can see here four damage and then his hit points or hp health points is uh looks like it's seven i believe so we go ahead and we put him over here turn this way into each oh we didn't go in and out yeah, yeah. that's cool i like that movement there we go. Snapped into place. Just requires a little bit more pressure. There we go. Um, I can show you. I don't know if I can rip it off again. Okay, so you see this uh, flat part here of the disc? It's the only f extended flat part here. That flat part's going to line up against the green flat side here, okay? That's how you get them on. So I put it over here, line it up, and it snaps right on. Okay, cool. And now they're going to do their fighting thing. You might just a single player camera mom. You got the camera, but I'll go ahead and have them fight. But we got to, oh, we got to have our like, I like the Scooby-Doo here. And so we're going to slide this in where, so we go to here, to the side. Oh, it's kind of a tight fit. There we go. Oh, push, push, push. Okay, then you can see the scoring cards up at the top. So they're supposed to start up at the highest score that there is. So I think they both start at 10. Does that put them in the green? Yeah, okay, so they're in the green here, okay? And so depending upon their damage that they do, so if I do a split with Shredder, his damage is gonna be a four if Leonardo does it, but for Shredder, he does a five. You don't wanna be hit by him, he does more. Okay, so let's go ahead and turn it on. Okay. Fight. Oh. 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 oh, look at Leonardo. <laughs> That's sad. He got split. So because you got a split and Shredder, when he does a split, he does five damage. I got to move our Nardo from a 10 down to a five. Oh no. Oh, he's in the danger, danger zone. zone. So we got to go ahead and like snap him back up. Let's see if it snaps back. Man, how many hits can these guys take? Also, it goes down, locks down. Oh, I didn't think I could put Humpty Dumpty back together again, but we did. Okay, guys, he's on Half-Life. So hopefully we can do this again. Let's do it. Fight. Go. You hear that cowabunga? He's dead. I mean, that's it. He gets five damage every single time. He's gone. Leonardo, how does he get, like, smacked? Let me see. I want to take... Oh, finally we got Shredder. He only got four damage. And that's how you build him back up. Look, he's got his cape ripped apart. So you put it back and you lock his head over so it keeps it there. I finally leave Leonardo one. It was just practice when he finally wins. Oh man, that's cool. And I love the sound effects and you can go ahead and change the background. You can add others too. So, you know, in this game, Shreds wins and Leonardo loses. Okay guys, so if you wanna do more than just what you have here, then you gotta collect more of them. And so we did, we got the uh, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles Battle Pack. In the Battle Pack, you can see on the front that we've got, let's see, Leonardo, Michelangelo, then Donatello, and also Raphael. And then you got Shredder on the back. It's got exclusive vintage colors. Well, what's interesting is that, I don't know if you can see it right here, but he has no shirt on or armor. He just in his skin. And then over here, he's got his purple outfit here, his armor on, so maybe that's why he's so tough. Now he's going to be easy to destroy here. How would you like to have two shredders? Let's go ahead and open it up. There's that one. And there's this one. Just probably a collector's guide here. 
Yeah, collector's guide and gameplay. So, you know, you want to make sure you understand the rules of engagement. So what if we do Leonardo? And again, the flat side to the flat side here. So let's go ahead and put that on there. And then we want Shredder. Okay, make sure that they're like locked because if they're necks up, then they just split apart. So we got to put their body back together and put their head down. And then we'll put Shredder there. And then if you notice on the sides, this is how you can keep scores. So they're supposed to start off at uh, 10. So we got to go all the way up to 10. So you can see the number zero to 10. And actually you got two sides. We can set them up to 10. And look, he's going to give him a smelly foot. Jack or treat, smell my feet. <laughs> <laughs> he lost. It wasn't even competition here. Okay, let's go with Leonardo. Let's get him close together and fight. Go fight, fight, go fight. Oh, God. Wow. He's down. Okay, let's bring up. Oh, he's already falling apart. Okay, Donatello with his bow staff. So do you think Donatello's a better fighter here? Okay, here we go. Man, so far, Shredder in both the battle arena and in the uh, five pack here, he's just like, and look, he's got a smelly feet up there too. Huh, all right, we'll try it again. Oh man, maybe the sides. Ooh, he's got his head on. He's not losing it. That's good. That bow staff, come on, get him. Get him. Big D, knock him with that bow staff. His foot's not even taking him out. He's got to do a head, get into his head. He just, yeah, he finally got knocked out. Oh man, who's going to take him on? I don't know if the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles are up for this man, but how about Ralph Mouth? Okay, here we go again. So far, Shredder hasn't lost his head yet, but let's see if the size do it. I know we're supposed to like mark him because if you look at the bottom of their disc, they have their damage and hit points. So he does a damage of, of four and uh, his health is, a, it looks like a nine. Yeah, that weighs as a six. Okay, this is it guys. Now look at these bad boys. Every time I pull them out, it's like their head comes apart. Okay, so Michelangelo, he ought to be able to really knock him out. I mean, look how big those things are. They're bad. They're beautiful. This is it, guys. So far, none of the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles have been able to take out shreds here. Here we go. That's it. They've all lost. And you can keep going down, down. But is it? One final test, guys. Is it really because I'm right-handed? Maybe. Let's try it again. No. Okay. All right. All right. All right. All right. All right. Let's do Shredder versus Shredder. Okay. This ought to be a good match. Maybe this will go forever because maybe they can't beat each other up. I'm the shredder. No, I'm the real shredder. No, you don't know how to shred cheese. I do. I cut him. Oh, stinky. Oh, what the heck? We lost something. Oh, it's his little, like, uh, shoulder pad here. It came right off. I, I don't think this is supposed to... He lost a tooth. <laughs> we got to finish this. Oh, my gosh. Yeah, that's pretty powerful. Maybe shredder wasn't supposed to battle shredder, but now he lost his shoulder pad. Oh, finally. Oh. So actually, this is the toughest shredder ever. And he did take him out, but that was only in practice, not in like real play, because we had to take it off. We turn off the music. And when, you know, once you take the music off, you lose half your world to fight. Wow, this guy is bad. You know what we do to bad people? We do the next best thing. We take him out with the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles Mutant Mayhem Nerf Gun. Where are the Nerf bullets? Oh, they're on the side. Oh, I thought they only give you two? Hold on, you gotta keep digging. Oh. <laughs> they give you lots more. And they got all the colors of the rainbow. I think there is orange for Michelangelo, purple for Shredder. Uh, well, actually that's red. I can see it now. Okay, there's red. And that's for Ralph Mouth. And then yellow. I don't think we have a yellow, but we're going to go ahead and load them up. This looks cool. Look, cornucopia of colors. I don't point it at the camera, but Camera Moms does have her safety glasses on, so she's ready. Okay, Shredder, you thought you could get away with this. I don't think so anymore. Go ahead, I'll make your day. Oh, gotta make sure it's pointed right at him. Here we go. 
<laughs> that was a good setup. Wow, that, I gotta see how far this actually shoots. Let me see. Oh, no way, man. That's at least 65 feet. That goes far. <laughs> that, I gotta, that's so cool, man. Oh, did you hear that? <laughs> that hit that, the box is over there. Oh man, that, that's flying. That's 65, uh, 70 feet, guys. This is a cool gun. This is the, one of the best Nerf guns that I fired, haven't fired in a long time. <laughs> I mean, just look at that beauty right there. Uh, it's hard. It looks kind of like soft and stuff, but man, that's got some firepower. You could really get an owie. Look, that's what happens when you hit him, you know? He's got X in his eyes. This is so cool. I gotta try it again. I love that sound. Woo! I like to hear the sound of that bell. Be sure to like and subscribe, guys. Thanks for watching. And which one is your favorite? The one that I shot off the table who actually had his armor on. He was the toughest out of all of them. But like I said, you guys can put him back up and you know, go ahead and put their heads back on and keep on battling. Thanks, guys. And now on to the Fortnite challenge where I'm going to win an Aikido Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle skin. And this one I'm going to pick Donatello with his bow staff. That's cool. The ninja stance Donnie. That's some cool moves. Hopefully we can do the same. Let's go. If you guys like to support me before you buy anything in the item shop, down below click on support a creator and then type in adventure fun, all one word. Click search, it finds me, there's a check mark, click cancel and you'll support me for two weeks. Doesn't cost you a thing and it helps me out. Thanks guys. Well, let's leave my mark. Gotta let them know that the big D's, whoop, the big D's here. Oh, it's in the grass. Okay, let's try that again, Mr. D. Yeah, don't come down, don't mess with me. I had a big D. That's right, I'm Donnie. I got my girlfriend named Marie. I'm Donnie, she's Marie. It's Donnie and Marie, yay! And Donnie always liked purple, so, God, how did this ever work out? <laughs> you wore a purple sock. It's just an old show. Purple socks was his thing, and he had his Easter named Marie. I don't think too many people landing at Grand Glacier. That's very pretty. Grab some ammo. <laughs> Nothing to shoot the ammo with. Let's break in to Grand Glacier Castle. <clears throat> Somebody's ticking somebody off, the uh, boss. Oh man, there we go. Finally got a shotgun. Not the my favorite, but. When in a pinch, it'll work. Okay, flowberry power. And I'll get some ammo here. Dun, 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 Oh, he spotted me. Oh, it's the big boss. I really don't have quite the weapons or the shield to fight you just yet. Man, destroying your own hotel. There you go. Don't destroy this five-star hotel. <laughs> oh, good. Well, okay. Fill up a little bit with the mini here. More flower power. Well, let's go get him. Let's go get him. Finally got a shotgun, something that I can work with. Oh, there he is. Major pummelage. No, don't. Oh, you powered up. You cheater. That's okay. I'll retreat. Oh, that's not helpful. Get rid of that camera and then the boss. Well, that's doing a fair job on him. And eat snow. Eat snow. Oh, you and your shockwaves. Um, something up here, Chief. Okay, a glitch. <laughs> oh, man. Dude, you like your shockwaves. Where's that other guy? Ooh, got some mobility. Good. Upgrade to an AR. Ooh, ouch. Ow, bye. I'm out of this five-star hotel, man. <laughs> Okay, I gotta get in there. I gotta take the other guy out before he takes the boss out. There we go. Oh, ho, 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 ho. I, I thought I got him. Where's that the pot? I don't know. Don't ah ha me. Uh, what the hey, man? 
They just throw me away like a bad piece of fish. Finally. Good gravy. Look at that. Got the mythic. All right. And then my shield's starting to heal up, up to 50 max. Then we got his uh, Montague's Enforcer AR. I'd like to get some practice with it. There you is. Face the Wrath of Montague's AR. Wrath, Wrath. There we go. Ooh, got a headshot. And a big pot. Let's take a potty break. Oh, there's a beautiful chest up there. Kind of like rainbowy in the fountain. That's pretty cool how they got that to rainbow there. I don't know how, but man, I'm in. Nothing was in there though worth having. Okay, let's try this again. Let's get back to the vault. The vault to mort Read my eyes. Look into my eyes. You will open, says me. Okay, let's open this rare chest. Shockwaves, yes. Oh, hammer pump shotgun? Hmm. I prefer the spaz shotgun. Let's go ahead and go to the workbench, see if I can, like, work on one of these. And go, can we, uh, increase reload speed? Yeah. Let's do that for the SMG, and we're good. Let's get some ammo over here, off the wall. Yeah, let's go for the sniper rifle. I'll keep the sniper rifle, but I'll get rid of Montague's gun just because I like the uh, scope better on the uh, SMG. Let's go ahead and get in the car and see if we can go find some action. And let's go ahead and go to my marker, hit the other edge of the circle, see if we can see anybody along the way. Okay, we got some action up here. Let's go see if we can get involved. <laughs> Don't always get involved. But I must. There they are. Let's see if I can smack one. Oh. And. Oh, they must have been low to get smacked by the car here and be eliminated. All right. Uh, nine players left. Oh. Ah. Oh. Jump scare. Hello. Whoa. Okay. Ouch. Okay, I guess they wanted the key card too. I was just trying to pick up the AR. See if I can get an upgrade. Oh. Not a lot of oomph in this car. Oh, okay. <laughs> they just like... Kiss oh, hey, whoa, that's so uncool. There we go. Yeah. That was a bit risky, but... Hey, that's right. I actually had a medallion, so uh, my shield got restored. Up to half shield. Cool. Man, that worked out well. Anything in here I can fill up on? Uh, flower power. Oh, good, some slurps. Let's go with the bow staff. That's cool. He just gives it a little bit of a display of like uh, acrobatic, like with his bow, and then he goes in for the smack. Personally, I wouldn't twiddle a little that long. I'd just smack it. <laughs> Is there like a medallion here somewhere? It shows it right around here. Oh, there it is. Wow, okay, sure, I'll take it. And, uh, Hyper SMG? I mean, the guys must have eliminated each other. Why wouldn't anybody take it? I like it. I got it. Cool. Well, let's go to zone. Oh, okay. Somebody's here to contest me. There you go. Oh, clean work. That Valeria's Hyper SMG does just smart work. Clean work. And four players left. Now, if I can just get the key card, am I going to make it? Is it worth it? Should I get it? Nah. I'll just hide up here in the bush and spy out and see if uh, I can snag anybody. Just align this perfectly. Now I'm back in the middle of the zone once the uh, storm shifts. Cool. Couldn't plan that better myself. Oh, somebody's coming. I hear footsteps. 
Oh, he's creeping up. Oh. Ouch. Cow, but he's just getting some good spams on me. Then he had his uh, riot shield. Okay, so, gal, now I'm up to 60% shield because I have two medallions. So I'm doing pretty good as long as he doesn't touch my head. Oh, hey, whoa. I got that girl from that one show. I don't remember that show. <laughs> Oh, which one survived? Okay, let's take the car. Let's go up and see. Oh, where'd he go? Oh, there he is. Oh, it's the girl survived. And she's got a hired on bot. It's okay. Let's just see where we end up here. Where does it shift now? Ooh, okay, perfect. Right my line of sight. Let's go ahead and uh, come out the backside, get out, and let's take to the bush. There we go. Three players left. And I want to pick them off as soon as they start coming my way, which I assume... Oh, there we go. She's up there with the bot. Oh, she's engaged. <laughs> to be sent back to the lobby. Oh, rats. Okay, 1v2. Oh, there's her head. Pokey, pokey. Oh, oh she's looking to snipe me. Okay, that's, that's not cool, man. That's not cool. I can't stay here. She keeps trying to snipe. Ouch. That's okay. I got medallions. As long as I don't get hit too hard. Okay. Oh, it's going back my way. I want to see if I can get the high ground. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. That's it. Stay away from that crown. 14. Ooh, yeah, she's gonna try to snipe me. Gotta go back the other way. Let's go. If I have to, I'll shock wave him into the storm. I'll take the bush up here. Oh! Yeah, I knew you were waiting for that. Fine, just gotta get my shield up with the two medallions. Just not get hit again. Okay, I want to shockwave you out of existence. <laughs> oh. Oh. Okay, shockwave time. Ouch. And I'm out of here. Ooh, storm, storm, storm. Let's go, go, go. Oh, yeah. That's what you get, man. That's what you get. Time to relax and have some pizza, guys. Thanks for watching. Be sure to like and subscribe. We'll have more pizza on the way. Or... Yay. The big D. He's with me. Please click on one of these videos for more events of fun.